Hey everybody, Dude Souls here, and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. Er, I guess welcome back to the title screen, because last time, we beat the entire royal family of Drang Lake. We started by taking down King Vendrick and putting him out of his misery, and then having ourselves a little bit of a three-boss gauntlet with the Throne Watcher and Defender, Queen Nishandra, and Aldia, the Scholar of the First Sin. Now, um, this is... Scholar of the First Sin Edition is, like, the definitive version of Dark Souls 2. Which means, well, of course, all the DLC is bundled in with this game. Oh yeah, it's time to play the DLC. Let's just take a look at the... Profile, PlayStation's gonna give me like the drop down menu for PlayStation Plus. No, go away. Alright, here we got Toogle. And you can see that I saved my game back in the Undead Crypt. Because once, it, if you're playing Scholar of the First Sin Edition, or, if you have downloaded the Crown of the Sunken King DLC, then there is a special interaction that you can find down in Vendrick's arena. Once you've obtained the Ashen Mist Heart, you can interact with Vendrick's armor. And you'll be teleported to somewhere special. Welcome to the memory of the king. Seeker of fire. Coveter of the throne. I am Vendrick, ruler of Drang Lake. As flame rises, so does it fade. Such is the way of things. Do you intend to link the fire? Then you must first take the throne, prove your worth, find the ancient crowns, Seek adversity, and they will be yours, and your wishes, granted, and your wishes. Alright, well, that's a pretty simple uh, explanation of what to do. Seek the ancient crowns. Yeah, if you try to leave the arena, then uh, it'll, it'll just fade out. I think that's Velstad back there, like just hanging out right behind Vendrick. So, I guess that's kind of interesting. All right, time to warp back to the bonfire. As for the order I'm going to be covering all the DLC in, I'm going to be covering it by release date. The first DLC released was the Crown of the Sunken King, which you can access from where you defeated the Rotten. All right, now let's just find the exit to the arena. There it is. And down this path, right past the primal bonfire, you may remember we have this big old shrine. This is where these specific keys come into play. The dragon talon, the heavy iron key, and the frozen flower. Each of these opens up a new DLC area. <clears throat> and if you're playing the original Dark Souls 2 and you bought the DLC, these would be immediately added into your inventory. However, if you're playing Scholar of the First Sin Edition, they are found just like scattered around Drang Lake. The Dragon Talon being in the Majula Hole, the Heavy Iron Key being in the Forest of Fallen Giants, and the Frozen Flower being in, in Drang Lake Castle. But now, it's finally time. We're finally going to be able to open these heavy stone doors. Yeah, as as I think I said before, this is a multiplayer lobby area. If you do not possess the DLC, you can lay your summon sign down here so people can summon you from within the DLC so you can like have a little bit of a trial run. But anyways, now, now that we have the Dragon Talon, we can finally open this giant door. We are immediately welcomed to... Uh, we are... Oh, th this perspective's kind of weird. 
we are almost immediately welcome to more caves. Ooh, there's a body. Three dragon charms. Okay. After heading through a series of tunnels, welcome to Shulva Sanctum City. Welcome to the underground labyrinth of this place. Uh, this is the part where- Whoa, what the hell? Oh, God, what the hell is that? Ooh, okay, that's a dr I should have been looking up. Okay, uh, this is the part where I say that I am going to be playing through the DLC functionally blind. I have never beaten any of the DLC packs. The most I've played is about half of the Sunken King DLC. I haven't even touched two of the other, like the other two. And I have also, well, and yeah, that's basically it for my personal experiences with the DLCs. Uh, I have seen just like a couple videos on like bosses and stuff. And like just reviewing bosses, so I do know how some of the bosses go. Uh, that's a new item. That is an old growth bomb. Old growth bomb. Uh, these are the other bombs, so I don't know where this is. Wait, I'm an idiot. I scrolled over it. Old growth bomb temporarily boosts strength. All right. Uh, let's head down here. Um. Alright, that's a shortcut from further into the level to the beginning. That, that's, uh. I guess we'll keep that in mind for later. Alright. Let's go down this cliffside path. The cliff is a little bit intimidating for me. Oh, hello. You are a ancient stone soldier, it looks like. Uh, relatively tanky. Yeah, I've heard that uh, the DLCs are, like, the peak of the difficulty in Dark Souls 2. Or, I guess, in any Dark Souls game for that. Why are there three of them? Ooh. Oh, you do poison damage. Okay, that's interesting. Ah. 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 Okay. Yeah, you do your swings, and ooh, these enemies are tankier than I was expecting. Okay, maybe maybe I should pop one of those growth bombs. All right. So I guess I I I see I'm in for a bit of a wild ride. We get a sanctum mace. Huh? That's marvelously convenient. How much damage does this does this do? Um. Wait, no, I'm scrolling into the Great Hammers. Where's the Sanctum Mace? Is it all the way at the bottom or something? There it is! 307- That is more ba- That has more base damage than the Demon's Great Hammer! Jesus Christ! Okay! Uh, that- That one mace is stronger than the Asylum Demon's weapon! Okay. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna be using archery a lot in this DLC. I forgot to actually equip my arrows. Alright. Let's equip the arrows. I, I keep on forgetting I have dark arrows with me. I have 15 of them and I know... You know what? No. I am going to equip them right here, right now, so I won't forget about them later. Good riddance, sir. Alright, now here's a gimmick that I actually remember from the time when I actually played this DLC. Uh, these, these pillars in the ground, if you attack them, they will twist, causing something to happen. Something like this. Just like random elements of the level shifting around. Just being caused by random pushes of a button. And I have no idea where you're going, good sir. I need to stop getting in the line of sight of those snipers over there. Oh, I don't like fighting here, because I'm on a cliffside, so I, like, I want to dodge, but I feel like I'm going to roll right off a cliff. 
Alright, well, the enemy's attack patterns aren't exactly hard to dodge. They just do a crap ton of damage. Ow. Oh, three of you? Hmm. It would be a nice time to have the, the proper stats to wield that triple crossbow. But I guess we'll just do this. Seems like this guy has more of a sword than a club. Got some poison moss. I feel like I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna equip that on my belt slot right here. Alright. Let's... Alright, hitting this is probably gonna bring up an elevator if I had to guess. I'm using my bow because I really want to preserve uh, durability on my stinger. Yep, brings up an elevator with a... I think these guys are called Sanctum Guardians or Sanctum Knights. I can't remember. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Almost fell off the platform right there. Um, That just brings up an enemy. Wait, do, do I just need to like drop down there? I think that might be what I have to do. I don't remember anything about the layout for this place. So, yeah. I'm just kind of stumbling. Or I'm just going to be stumbling around all these DLC locations. Uh... Random pocket right! Oh, that's a jerk move. Leading me to a dead end and then sticking a powerful enemy right behind me. Thanks, FromSoft. I really appreciate it. Alright, um... What's over here? Ah, oh, we got a Lance variant, I see. Uh... That is a very weird attack animation. That leaves me that leaves you very vulnerable to me walking behind you and stabbing you. Poison stone right there if you don't have enough poison already. Uh what does this do? Oh. Hello. Ah, I see. So if I want to go back up there, I think I could grab another item. I don't know how I would get back up there though so I'm gonna I'm gonna forget about that uh what's in here nothing ooh almost walked right off of this thing uh it's weird geometry um what's the difference between absolutely nothing I have hello oh that's a bunch of bugs in that room that's lovely all right I'm gonna trigger this thing I don't know what that does Probably should take out the enemies before I... Oh, I know that. That makes it easier to... Oh, I just dropped down right on an enemy. I was gonna say... And the bugs are out. Okay, I don't want to find out what those bugs do. They might be corrosive because... I mean, I don't know. But bugs are commonly associated with corrosion in this game. So, Oh, where did you come from? Were you the archer that I annoyed? earlier all right well yeah let's just take advantage of your lance attacks and just get right behind you and do the pokey pokey and yep that was the never mind the, there's an archer right there oh that's just lovely I was gonna say like I swear this place's gravity is increased but no like, a bunch of my jumps just, like, weren't going through. Alright. What do you do? Uh, that extends out a bridge, which appears to be right behind a bunch of poison vats, so that's nice. Five lightning urns down here. And you... Um... What do you do? Oh wow, that 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 would have been good to know. All right. Uh do I want to go down there or over here? I'm going to go down here first cuz I feel like that's more progression-y. Bunch of these poison statues. I think I've heard of this enemy. Wait. Okay. I know this might be a little bit of a spoiler for the DLC like enemies. But I know there is a kind of enemy that is basically a cluster of poison statues, but it can walk. It walks slowly. It's like a 
crawling around, but still. A massive poison spit can just, like, follow you around. And, you know, they're statues. You can't exactly kill them. So you just kind of got to deal with it. Uh, yeah, this looks like it results in a dead end, so I'm going to say this is not progression. Uh, 30 magic bolts down there. What is this place? Oh, hi there. You you were going to get me to roll into all those po poison jars, weren't you? Not today, buddy. It looks like it's just a hole down there, and I don't exactly want to jump through. We get a dried root. What does that do? Uh... Oh, I'm getting shot at. Alright, dried... Here it is. Restores HP for a long period. Oh! Oh, so it's... Oh, so it's kind of like a... Elizabeth mushroom, I guess? Hmm. I might use that. I mean, it seems farmable from enemies, technically. So, you know. Oh, that looks really progression-y. I should have gone the other way. Yeah, I definitely should have gone the other way. This is definitely the way forward. Uh, are you going to come out and attack me, or are you just going to sit here? I could, felt, I could feel myself inching off of that platform. Oh, oh where did you come from? Ow. All right. All right. Looks like this takes me back. Oh. Oh, I see. All right. So this building equals progression. So I should head back to the place where I propped up the bridge over there. Um. That did something. Can't exactly tell what though. Uh. The si Oh. Oh. Oh, where did all those arrows come from? I just got hit by like three arrows at once. Okay. Oh, of course they have Estus. Well, why wouldn't they have Estus? Just... Mmm, from soft. Dude's prancing. Alright, uh... <laughs> Alright, time to grab the items. Three Twinkling Titanites. Alright. There's a bunch of these pillars that I want to shoot. You. You. Alright, these seem to just... Alright, those are just pulling up platforms. I saw you back there. Uh, here's what... Ooh, I probably should have hitched a ride on that. Oh, I definitely should have. Actually, no, wait, where do I... Where would I even be going from there? Alright. Um... Oh, uh, the, there's an example of the walking poison statue. Oh, wait, you can kill. Oh, oh, it has a face. Ew. I'm assuming it's just if you attack the, the actual, like, I don't know, tortoise part of it, then it can be killed. But, uh, you know, that's fun, I guess. Um, another one. All right. Around here is nothing, so I'm gonna walk up. I'm I'm gonna climb up this ladder, and seems like I've made myself a bridge. There's an item down there, which seems like a bit of a risky jump. Oh, it's a bonfire. Oh, nice. Oh, that's nice. Okay, cool. Uh, I, before, before I end anything, I do want to head back to the bridge area that I propped up earlier. Yeah, you can see, like, the reptile that's, like, holding the statue. Yeah, nothing happens if you shoot directly at the statue, but if you shoot at the turtle, then, yeah, it'll die. All right. Uh, let's destroy these pots from afar. Because no doubt these are poisonous. Wait. Oh, they're totally just not poisonous. Oh, that that's that's nice too. 
Uh, looks like there's a bunch of bugs in this place. Uh, Alright. Bug on the ceiling. Hmm, what, what happens if I shoot one of these? Oh, yep, that's corrosion. That's orange. Orange equals corrosion. Uh, I'm gonna need my bow out for this place. Yeah, shoot you down. Yep, corrosion mist. Why is it always the bugs and the corrosion mist? Oh, that's, that's, uh, multiple bugs, buddy. Where did, oh, oh, you're actually kind of fast, too. All right, uh, well, you can die, please. And, uh, hey, hey, stop farting. Stop, stop emit. Is this bug bugged? The bug's bugged. <laughs> the bug's bugged with the bug's butt. I don't know. Is that all of them? Because it better be. Yes? Good. Uh, ooh, item. Elizabeth mushroom. Nice. And over here is the... No! <laughs> Entrance of that building. Hmm. This might be a stupid idea, but I kind of want to see if I can successfully, like, run back to that area to go grab all of my souls and just, like, teleport out of there. Because I know there's going to be all of these soldiers on my ass. And I just want to see how far I can take this. Oh, there's the bugs too I have to deal with. Alright. I just have to make it up the staircase. And then hit the... Hit the feather. Alright. And... Oh, that, that was actually really easy. Haha. -ha, you can't get me. I'm in the animation. Alright, that was a success, so now, I guess let's just head down this bridge, just to see, see how everything's going. Alright, so these are not poisoned. That's good to, n oh, that would have been a good drop, drop attack area on you. If I actually knew you'd be down there, okay. Uh, come on, oh uh, no. I figured out, like, a combo attack where I can, like, do a backstab and then, like, immediately go into a strong attack, which will, like, uh, catch the enemy, like, before its iframes, like, go into effect after getting backstabbed. Alright, um, so that temple is definitely the way forward. Uh, so I'm just going to make a prediction. Again, I don't exactly know how this place goes, but I'm going to be going through there, heading up the pyramid. That seems like the way out. Oh, wait, no, that's completely cut off. Um, up there? No, that wouldn't really make sense. It, there has to be something to do with the dragon that I saw at the be that we saw at the beginning. Uh, before we head into the pyramid, uh, let's just, uh, go through this building. Uh, this is definitely some elevator. Like, there's a button on the floor, but I can't exactly activate it. Alright, yeah, that's, that's something that has to do with the dragon. It, it, it just, it just, it just bombed the bridge. It just bombed the bridge. All right, that that's that's cool. I don't think there's anyone on the bridge, but all right. Focus souls. Focus souls. Uh, is that a sorcery? No. Yes. Yes, it is. An ancient sorcery of Sholva, the Sanctum City, fires a focused beam of souls. Ah, it's the hyper beam attack that Freya and Nishandra had. Huh. So I guess now you can finally use it for yourself. Oh, wait, no! The dragon did kill people on the bridge. Thank you, dragon! Ooh. Ominous temple opening. Alright. Is this a new area, or is this just Sol Sholva extend extensions? 
Yep, new area, Dragon Sanctum. Uh, oh god, more singing. Uh, last time we were in a singing area, it was the worst air. It was the worst goddamn area of the entire, of the entire game. Like literally, uh, Share Factory wouldn't let me export it because that video was so long. Because I kept dying, so I had to trim out like ten minutes of it. Ugh. All right, so those are enemies. I know that. There's something bleeding back there. It looks like. All right, we have a button right here so let's just activate this that opens up this door which gets us an item soul of a great hero and three dragon charms all right uh down Ooh, that's a broken staircase so that's not a good idea to go down into uh that it that is a witch right there that i'm just gonna snipe from all the way over here i don't even want to go into the room while she's still up there i see there's something above her uh th that looks like just a regular like sanctum enemy yeah oh i guess those witches die in a poison mist hmm. all right uh these got Oh, I remember these guys' gimmick. I think these guys are called, like, Dragon Shrine Knights or something like that. Basically, they're in their ghostly forms, and those are their bodies on those operating tables. Destroy the bodies, and they, and they will be returned to their uh, corporeal form, where you can actually attack them. So, yeah. Use your ranged weapon that I sincerely hope that you've had for the entire game up to here and uh yeah i i remember these enemies because i remember they gave me so much trouble because i had no idea how to fight them just probably just because they were big and tall and had two swords and i was the kid who hid behind their shield all the time because i didn't know how to play souls games and i didn't know that i actually had to be good at timing so i just sat behind a shield and didn't do anything which is why i found the flag style sentry hard to fight when i first fought it ah uh, yes back in my day when i was a noob at this game and the flag style sentry was actually hard well i guess i do like raiding the entire ship so that takes out some of the challenge wait are these these guys are affected by poison I did not expect that, considering their entire city is made of poison. Uh, or I guess poisonous enemies. All right, we got one, two, three, four, five chests. All right, at least one of these has to be poisonous, right? Or, or a mimic. Destruct fifty destructive great arrows. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna go ahead and shoot every single one of these chests. Because one of them has to have something. Alright. Katarina Helm. That sounds interesting. You're not a mimic. You're not a mimic. And you're not a mimic. Alright, that's fine. Alright. Katarina Helm. What does this look like? Oh! It's the Onion Helmet. This helmet appears rather absurd, but its multi-face construction is in fact quite practical as it effectively deflects physical attacks. The old tales speak of brave Katarina knights wearing this helmet as they rush courageously into battle. Oh, that's funny. I'm not going to equip it because it's worse, but still. Yeah, it just doesn't, doesn't fit my aesthetic. Haha, <laughs> fashion souls. Another soul vessel. If you want to respect your character for a... Uh, fourth, fifth, fifth time, then yeah, go ahead. Old Growth Balm. Th th those are the strength increasing ones, right? Yeah. I might have to pop one of those someday. And chest number five contains a Titanite Slab. Yeah, we have no use for that. We have better weapons. Oh, th oh, this is this is totally the area above where. Oh, now you're coated in poison. Oh, that's just lovely. All right, 
So it seems like this is above that big old area with the stairs being cut off. So my prediction is that if I would have gone down those stairs, then I would be immediately mobbed by every single enemy that was hanging out in the windows. Alright. Yeah, good thing I equipped my poison moss. Because these guys are going to be annoying. And you still have a bunch of these enemies just kind of hanging out on the ground. Oh, 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 no, no. Oh, oh, that's the... Wait, is that the pressure plate? Oh, oh, that genuinely jump scared me. Oh, God. I'm not that loud because it's like 1 a.m. right now. But, oh, jeez. Okay, that's not cool from soft. Oh, that is not cool from soft. I mean, I guess I did really let down my guard and there were more groups of enemies in that room, but I didn't know they were gonna attack. They were just like hanging out, just like sitting down on the floor like good little skeletons. Like they weren't attacking me. What are these guys even? Are they zombies? Are you a hollow? Are you a skeleton? Are you a stone golem or something? Eh, they just, they just, they just look like hollows to me. This chest right here is suspicious. Alright, it's not a mimic. It's gonna have a trap to it. Yep, I was right, I was right, I was right. Ow. Did an enemy shoot me or was, it, was, was that the arrow trap? Alright, three dried roots. Uh, let's just take out these enemies from above. Alright, is there anyone else that needs me to stab them in here? No. Oh, you. I will stab you from afar. Alright. Uh, let's check out... Alright, human effigy right there. Let's check out these sanctum gauntlets. Would they, would these be worth, uh, trying out? Probably not, but hey, who knows? No, they are absolutely horrible. The, uh, those could not be upgraded to be good at anything. Ah, alright, this is, this is, this is kind of interesting, I guess. Like, getting different lines of sight. That's a fun little gimmick, I guess. I don't know. It's not that interesting. Uh, I feel like there's gotta be some illusory walls somewhere. Oh, this place is full of traps. I'm gonna pull out my bow. Um. That's. Okay. That is an item. Repair powder. That's useful. Um. Ooh, that's a. Is, oh, no! Oh, I hear bugs. I hear bugs. Alright, there's bugs right there. Okay, uh, this is not fun. I I see I see the knight over there. Hmm. Do I drop down where all the bugs are, or do I go in the spiky area with the witch and a and a sanctum shrine knight? Yeah, I'm gonna call them shrine knights. Uh, there is a witch over here that I'm just gonna snipe. I don't want to deal with her. I'm going to have to, like, Metal Gear this. Oh, that's going to be impossible. I think I just need to, like, run up until I find this guy's body. And then immediately... Oh! Oh, no! There's both of them are out. Okay. Um. Uh, sirs, where are your bodies? I, I need to destroy them, please. Uh, human effigy... Oh, God, I have 29,000 souls. Um, oh, I'm screwed, aren't I? Alright, the 15 minutes of a torch. Oh, this this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. I, sh I should have gone with the bugs. What, actually, what happens if I do attack you in your ghostly form? Absolutely nothing. Alright, that, that's exactly what I expected. Well, I guess technically I was expecting it to do, like, I don't know, like 20 damage, but... I mean, I guess 20 damage and 0 damage are basically the same in Dark Souls. Alright, you... 
hopefully can't climb ladders? No? Good. I almost just walked right down into them. Alright. Uh, where are your bodies? Are they over here? Oh, another... A witch... Third dragon ring at risk. Oh, that's just lovely. Alright. Um, third dragon ring is at risk. I don't know where these guys' bodies are. Uh, hopefully down here is just like a room with a bunch of... Oh, Jesus. Okay. Uh, there's one. That restores you. Oh, why are there so many of them all in one room? You know what? I, I just need to go around getting all the bodies so I can take out the earlier guys before I get in here the next time I return. Mmm. Okay. Get you. Get you. 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 Ah! Ah! Oh, of course you have crossbows. Why don't... Oh, of course you have burst crossbows. Why wouldn't you? I just drank a Estes flask right in front of your face. And I swear someone just fell into the pit. Ow. Oh, one of them's still a ghost. Because that, that's, that's fair. Where is your body good, sir? Okay, third dragon ring's broken. GG. I'm calling it a night right there. Good night, guys. This DLC is kind of fun so far, but also... Actually, no, I, 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 I can't really say much. Yeah, it is kind of fun so far. Uh, yeah, um, we made it through what's probably not all of the Shulva Sanctum City. We made it through what's probably a decent portion of the Dragon Shrine. I say that's good progress. Um, see you guys in the next episode. Guys, I'm tired. It's 1 o'clock when I'm recording this. <laughs>